For all the talk of offense, St. Mary's rushing defense is the class of the Western Buckeye League. They're only the only defense holding opponents to less than 100 rushing yards per game. A tough task tonight, perhaps, against the Salina rushing attack, averaging just under 300 yards per game. Of course, Wapakoneta was able to stymie them last week in the Battle for Grand Lake that you can catch tomorrow night on WOSN at 7. How about the Rough Riders, Sean Perry, FCA leaders leading the way or following his leaders, that offensive line down inside the five, and that sets up this. Ty Schlosser, touchdown St. Mary's, another FCA member, seven to nothing. Then a similar run to the last drive, it's Perry following all those guys down to the one yard line, touchdown saving tackle there, but Braden Dunlap will sneak his way home for a 14 nothing Rough Rider lead as they look to move to eight and zero on the season. Salina now. Hand off to Kyle Zizzleman, who's zizzling his way for nine yards. Then it's the quarterback, Brett Schwederman. Keeps it on the run pass option. First down and more. He wasn't going to pass it. Who are we kidding? Schwederman then keeps it again. Good pickup here. Second quarter now. Schwederman taking off, trying to get Salina into the end zone. Inside the 40, inside the 35. Fourth down now, the pass is tip to Eddie Fowler, who takes it all the way for a pick six, 21 nothing. Rough Riders could be a Layfeld industrial supplies and welding top five play next week. We will find out then. They're not done yet, are these St. Mary's Rough Riders in the rivalry game. Dunlap going to Ty Howell, 35 yard touchdown. He's wide open. That makes it 28 to nothing. St. Mary's pitches the shutout, 42 to nothing. And Eric Spicer pointed out on Social media, I believe, Salina hasn't scored at Skip, Skip Bachman Stadium since 2014, is what he said. And of course, this is the last meeting between these two teams at the Skip. Eight no Rough Riders.